Hey guys, it's Chris Appleton, and today I'm gonna show you a game-changing blowout technique, and I'm gonna let one product do all the work. Over the years, I've kind of become known for the looks hair texture, and everyone's number one question is how do I achieve it? Guys, it's as simple as this. The Dream Coat has literally transformed not only your hair game, but also my hair game, because it transforms any texture of hair, even the frizziest. Not only does Dream Coat have the transformation power, but it also has the staying power. We got you covered, because when you go outside, this has waterproof technology, so we know that no moisture or humidity is gonna get in the hair and change your style. Okay guys, so I'm gonna start applying the product. Now, this is really, really important, because this is where all the work comes in. All we're gonna do is prep the hair using the Dream Coat, making sure that each strand of hair is saturated from roots to ends, so all of the hair gets the same technology. So in my experience, I've never felt anything so light on the hair. It's literally as light as water. Now, I think most people, when they're using styling products, they worry about the hair getting greasy or heavy, and you do not need to worry with Dream Coat because it doesn't do any of that. You won't even feel it in the hair, that's how light it is, but making sure that we saturate each strand of hair will really help us get that perfect blow dry from root to tip. The reason that we're applying the hair from root to tip and making sure each strand of hair has equal amounts of Dream Coat on is because the product itself actually goes inside the hair and wraps itself around and protects it from the humidity. So whether I'm in Miami and it's humid or I'm in London and it's raining, I know that Dream Coat has always got my back. All right guys, now the hair is saturated in Dream Coat, we're gonna get to drying. Now, my tip to dry the hair is to dry 80% of the hair by just blast drying. We wanna keep this as fast as possible. If you're anything like me, I don't like to spend a long time blow drying the hair. I'm gonna let the product do all the work. So we're gonna take 80% of the water out and then we're gonna hit it with a brush. We're gonna take some large sections of hair. I'm using a large bristle brush. My number one tip, to get the perfect blow dry is to keep tension in the hair so you can lock in that dream coat and you can see all of those beautiful results. Even though we want the hair smooth, I don't want it super flat to our head. So I'm gonna blow dry the hair forward without a part. So we can flip the hair from side to side. We can even let it land in the middle and you'll just have that little bit of volume. It will frame the face nicely and the hair will fall away from the face and not into it. Okay guys, so now we've blown the hair out, as you can see. Super beautiful blowout, sexy, gorgeous hair. And remember we said that we're not gonna blow dry it with a part. Now the reason I don't like to blow dry it with a part is so you get this volume. It doesn't matter what side you throw it over to, the hair should flip and be flexible. What I also just love about this Dream Coat, and I've never found a product that works like this, is not only does it transform the texture, but the hair is so light. The hair still has body and volume, it's not flat to a head, and it doesn't feel sticky or stiff. All right, guys, as you can see, she has an incredible shine to the hair and that really beautiful, luxurious finish. Now, not only will this look amazing, it's also feeling amazing. It's as light as water, you literally can't feel like there's anything in the hair. But to finish the look off and give you that real red carpet worthy blow dry, I'm gonna put a bit more of a bend in the hair so you can really get that eye-catching finish. We're gonna pull the front up and give you that half up snatch. I love this look because it pulls it off the face, but you still have all that beautiful hair that we blow dried in the back. What we're gonna do to create this look is take a section from just above the ear and then section it all the way up to the crown and repeat that on the opposite side. Then we're gonna take the Colorwell Cult Favorite hairspray and we're gonna saturate the first inch of the root with the hairspray. This is gonna give us great control and give you that real perfect snatch. If you want to as well, a nice little tip is just to open the hair up a little bit so you can get all of those roots, especially if you have thicker hair and you really wanna get a bump-free ponytail. My top tip to get the perfect snatch is to follow the cheekbones. Honestly guys, it's a complete game changer. So you wanna follow the cheekbones, take your brush and brush the hair right up. This is the difference between it looking like a regular pony that you're gonna to take to the gym or something that's red carpet worthy. Okay guys, now we've got that in position. Remember we're following the ears and landing it on top where the crown is. We're gonna tie it with a regular black elastic, nice and tight. When you tie in your ponytail elastic, make sure you keep it really low towards the base of the ponytail so you get a much tighter finish. As you can see, that really sits into place and you get some nice volume in there as well. Next, guys, to make the ponytail look a little bit more professional, I like to take a small piece from underneath, we spray it with the Cult Favorite hairspray and we're just gonna wrap it around that elastic just to hide it and make it look a little bit more polished. All right, guys, now the hair is half up. I think she looks amazing, but we're gonna give it that super expensive looking finish by adding one of my favorite go-tos, the Extra Shine Spray. This stuff transforms the texture and gives it that kind of diamond-like shine. So the way I like to use it is to actually saturate the hair in it once the hair is dry, and then I take a large curling iron 
and I'm literally just going to kiss the very ends of the hair just to give it a bend. We don't want to make the hair particularly curly, I'm just going to use a large curling iron and bend the ends under. Just so as the hair falls forward, it has that cute little kick. No perfect snatch would be complete without using the Colorwell Root Touch Up Powder. I like to use it on everyone to fill out the hairline, especially when you're wearing the hair up. This really transforms any hairline into a much fuller, thicker looking hairline. Most of the time people's scalps are a different colour, uh, especially when we're doing makeup, you know, I feel like the scalp doesn't get any sun. This is a great way of giving you a flawless hairline, especially if your hair is finer, which most people's are. And what I love about this is it doesn't go anywhere, so once you put it on the hair, it stays exactly in place, it's even swim proof. Sometimes I cheat it and I actually change the hairline a little bit, so I'm going to bring a hairline down a little bit lower with the powder. It's a great way to fill it out and even out your hairline. So guys, you can see the difference from this side where we filled it out and then this side where there isn't any. It's a clear difference and I've actually lowered a hairline to make it look fuller and make it look more even. So now I'm going to complete the other side. And it doesn't matter if you're not brunette, guys. This comes in every color. We've got it in blonde, red. We got you covered with your platinum. Don't worry, we've got a color that will suit everyone. Okay guys, so when you finish, you should have something that looks like this. Super glossy, beautiful, bouncy, red carpet worthy hair. I think it's a really cute style, it looks very chic, but what I love about it is it has that immaculate luxury finish. Okay guys, my secret to red carpet hair, the perfect finish. It's actually a really simple hairstyle, and 80% of the time the hairstyles are just a ponytail or something basic, but it's all about getting that perfect precision in the texture of the hair. Using the Dream Coat with the Extra Shine Spray enables me to do that no matter what the hair texture and also no matter what the weather circumstances, I know it's got my back.